Hello and welcome back to another episode of Last Shot. In case you haven't watched the previous episodes, here's a quick recap of what happened so far. Wornado, while I really like him, he still didn't manage to get off my bad list. Countdown did get off my bad list though, due to me purchasing the rest of his upgrades and realising how awesome he really is. I still have a massive bone to pick with Funny Bone though, because his first move is the only good move that I use of him, and thus he's more than deserving to stay on my top 10 worst. And then to my surprise, Chill was actually overpowered. After Shroom Boom's turn, I still wasn't 100% fond of him, but he was still good. Freeze Blade. Uh, yeah, moving on. Okay, here's the better water swapper. Washbuckler was actually a fantastic swapper. And finally, Spyro, I learned to like his moveset. So now that we got the recap out of the way, now let's look at everyone's favorite text calendar, Sprocket. Um, this is gonna be a good one. Oh gosh, golly gee, where to start with Sprocket? Got a fella BR, a Danish store by the way, and I do not know why I got her. I mean, she does have like a cool tank, not gonna lie, but her design as a whole isn't really memorable. She's just a golden figure with red hair carrying a spanner around, or something like that. I mean, I don't even know a single person who likes Brockett, probably except for Alec Windmiller, but that's about it really. I think I sort of agree so far with the community that Brockett sucks, but Maybe she might impress me. Nah, you know what? Chances are unlikely. Alright, I got Scanlander's Giant set up. Let's place Pocket on the portal. Fixes in. Huh, I actually got a lot of wraps for her. Okay, so she can ride in the tank. Oh no, it's not a maneuverable. This is gonna be so exciting. I am totally gonna love Sprocket so much. Let's upgrade her. Okay, this could be a helpful move. Notice how I said could. Welcome back. Okay, so we can either do this path or... I'm gonna try this one. Well, I can't get more. Hooray. So how about this? Let's go to my favorite Skylanders Giants level. With my least favorite Skylanders Giants character. How's about that? Skylanders of the Tech are stronger than this. Oh, I'm Tech. Well, this gives me an unfair advantage. I mean, this gives me a fair advantage. Man's gonna try in the tank. This it did like no damage. That that wasn't even that fun. That wasn't even remotely fun. Oh, 
Well, that took me a while. Whereas if I played with someone else like Drill Sergeant, it would have taken me no time. At speed. Job well done. No, job badly done. Why does Rocket have more quotes than Jewel Sergeant? Oh, hey, Cake. What is this damage? This damage, man. Very stereotypical builder personality. I mean, the engineer has more death than her. Oh, he killed himself with a mine. Perhaps the most far damage I ever would get when playing as Rocket. Oh, hey, look. Look at these bombs. Guess what? They're better than Rocket's actual movesets. I swear it's pocket if you say job well done one last time. At this point I just feel like mocking Sprocket. Oh hey look, I'm dying. I wonder whose that fault is. Oh hey look, I died. And I didn't even go to the Drill X boss battle. Okay, okay, you know what? You know what? Screw Sprocket. Let's play some much better Skylander. Let's put Drill Sergeant in. Do you know why? Because Drill Sergeant is actually good. See? I took this guy down in no time. No time. Anyway, now it is time for my final thoughts and Sprocket. And by golly gee, they aren't gonna be good ones. Okay, this is why, this is the whole reason why Drillex's Big Rigs is my favorite level in Giants. I mean, what can be more creative than this? Also, I'm playing as Drill Sergeant. Drill Sergeant vs. Drill X. Battle of the Drills. And Drills. The, the main drills.
I have something to confess. The whole reason why I placed Rocket on my top 10 worst is because I heard how so many people hated her, and I don't really have much memories playing as her when I was younger, so that's why I placed her there. But now that I gave her a good run, I realised how terrible she is. I mean, you saw how angry I was when I lost her, sir, in my favourite level of giants, to a point where I had to switch to Drill Sergeant. She is that bad, and I agree with you guys. I thought her first attack, her primary move, I thought that was fine, but it actually isn't. It's terrible. Her secondary move is also terrible, and her third move is nigh unplayable. Still my top 10 worst, for sure. However, Sprockets does have at least one more chance to not be the worst guy in existence. Because our next episode, and our finale of the series, we'll be looking at Stark's Lobbertooth. Like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.